I need to hurry. Frau Beckmann said she will be waiting for me on the square at the top of the main street. Big day today. Hey, da Herr Baumgartner's bakery. Usually love the place. Everybody does at the academy. But today I'm much too nervous to eat a strudel. I'm sure you'll give our ears a real treat. Looks like everyone left in a hurry. Oh my goodness, they must all be waiting for me on the square. at all. I wonder if Papa would sell it in his shop, though. Goodness! A rock? Oh no. Vandals. Are you all right? None for the worse for wear. What worries me is it's getting worse every day. That's what my father says. Never mind, eh? <laughs> Always look on the bright side. At least, it's prompted me to make some repairs that I've been putting off. Do you know who did this? I've got a good idea, yes. Good for nothing hoodlums. I see who you mean. They only feel big and strong when they're together, though. Right. But people like that can be dangerous when they're driven by an ideal. Especially when it's based on hate and the rejection of other cultures. And they hold no love for Vagarans, that's for sure. My parents and I are Vagarans. Well, in that case... I wish you well. Troubled times are these, young lady. For people like us. Ah, enough talk of nastiness. Ah. I see you're carrying a music case. Would you be the lucky young lady who is to enchant our ears this year? I am. Um, and I should go. It's nearly time. Well... Let me congratulate you first. Music is one of the few pleasures left to us nowadays. So, thank you, Fraulein. Thank you for spreading it around. Would you like to do me the honor of writing something in the cement before you go? I'll... I'll add the date like they do in Hollywood. It's all the rage these days, you know. Well, I... Unless you're worried, it would make you late. All right. I will. Here you go. Ah, lovely. The great white swan of Wagen. The immortal symbol of our beautiful town. A very fine inscription indeed. And one that will no doubt be here for many years to come, whatever may become of us now. Thank you, mein Herr. 
I really should go now if I don't want to be late at the Music Academy. I'll be listening from here. Thank you. Goodbye. What's the point of damaging books? It's disgraceful. Same thing happened last month to the shop of Papa's friend, Herr Zimmer. At least, if my concert's a fiasco, I'll still have left my mark here for posterity. The ghetto. Mama and Papa often talk about it when they think I'm not listening. They say that more and more Vagarians are being forced to live here. Anyway, I'd better not hang around or I'll end up being late at the square. Is it that late already? Paul Beckman will kill me if I don't get to the square on time. Damn bloody Vagaran! Go on, hop it! Don't want your sort of hanging around here. The National Socialist Party of Osterthal. I think that's what Papa calls the Brown Shadow. Nothing but yobs in uniform, according to him. I'd better not hang around here. Good grief. Guten Tag, Frau Beckmann. Ah, oh, Frau Line Rose, there you are. A few minutes more, and you would have been late. Please excuse me, Frau Beckmann, but uh, I was delayed on the way. May I have your convocation notice? Thank you, Fraulein Rose. Now, remember, performing at the annual Spring Concert is a great honour and rewards the best Music Academy student of the year. So it is imperative that you show yourself worthy. I will do my best, Frau Beckmann. The piano is ready. Make this day yours, Dana Rose.
Everything's ready. All I need to do now is arrange my sheet music and begin.
God, another day of hard labor. What are you gonna do now, Kate? Jeez, can't believe it's been almost a year since the militia sent me here. Gotta get out, move on. Whatever that might be. But how, though? No news from outside, nothing. Does anyone even know I'm here? Someone must be looking for me, mustn't they? Mustn't they? I imagine you are aware of the business that brings me here. My name is Kate, Kate Walker. My company is in charge of negotiations for the takeover of this factory. I am afraid that the sale of the Vorlberg factory is not as straightforward as it first seemed. There is a, an heir, Miss Walker. Where can I reach him? Hans Vorlberg is somewhere in Siberia. Allow me to introduce myself. I am model XC2000. My common name is Oscar. You said you were a train engineer? What do you think you're doing, Kate? I wanted update. I wanted results. Kate, hey, please! Olivia, tell me what's going on. I'm well aware that this trip has taken me far from New York and far from the Kate you once knew. Are you leaving us, Kate Walker? And you know what surprises me the most? I don't miss it. Take me to Siberia, Kate Walker. I promise, Hans Valberg. What news have you got? Kate Walker's gone, far away, into another world. It was really a beautiful voyage. Now, it is time to say goodbye. Hunter! French is too far gone. We're losing her. She ain't gonna be coming back. Three months ago, nomads found her dying in northern Siberia. Born in New York in the United States. Walker. Kate Walker. She's very quickly going to become a problem. Kate Walker will always represent a problem for us, and also for our cause. How did I end up here? We Yukos migrate with our snow ostriches to the sacred lands. Miss Walker, the Justice Department is looking for you, you know. I'm not going back to New York with you. Duk -duk! It's a long journey, a very special journey.
sleep okay? Like a bear. Yeah, I heard. Better get ready, Katusha. Mm, I feel like I've been run over by a tank. You okay? Sure. Digging an assault mine 12 hours a day in the hope of finding a fragment of ivory? Couldn't be better. Don't let it get to you. Maybe I'm a fool, Kate. Maybe I should have listened to my folks. If I had stayed in line in the National Choir like a good little pawn instead of forming an anti-establishment punk group, I would not be here now. I'm glad I've got you, though. Listen, Katusha. We're going to get out of here, right? Yeah, right. If you say so. Today's the day we're supposed to take over from Team Orange in Gallery C, right? Don't remind me. They say it's really tough. Isolated with no rescue party on hand. Which is crazy, because it's the worst gallery for cave-ins. We should get going, Katusha. I mean, what if the guard catches us slacking off when we should be ready? Who, Simona? She's no altar girl, but she's not the worst around here. True. But I will be ready in time to leave. I just want to get all the rest I can. Come on, Katusha. Better get ready. Sure. Okay. Five minutes. No more. Da? Da. Better not forget your good luck charm. Don't think I've ever seen you without it. It's all I got left. There's all Oscar's data inside. I was lucky enough to steal it from the militia soldier who picked it up at the frontier between Baraner and the Yakast. I just need to find a compatible body for it. That is, if I ever get out of here. There's all Oscar's data inside. I was lucky enough to steal it from the militia soldier who picked it up at the frontier between Baraner and the Yakast. I just need to find a compatible body for it. That is, if I ever get out of here. you're here. Let's stay close, Katusha, okay? Team Blue! Hey, you've got mail. It's for you, Americanska.
Thanks. No stalling you here. I... you got five minutes to see what's inside. Or else a less friendly face will come to get you. This melody stuck with me throughout my childhood. I remember even my mother couldn't find out what it was called. It belonged to my mother. I used to play with it when I was a kid. It belonged to my mother. I used to play with it when I was a kid. Olivia Foster, New York. What could she have sent me given our dispute after my leaving with Hans? Strange. What? August 23rd, 2003. Dear Kate, wherever you are now, Despite the sad news it contains, I hope this letter reaches you in time for you to make preparations to return to New York. Your mother, Sarah Walker, passed away last night at Mount Sinai Hospital. She had been doing poorly for several months and her death was no doubt a release. The funeral will take place Thursday, next week. We push back the ceremony so you can be with us. If I'm not mistaken, returning to the United States means you run the risk of having to answer to the law. Sometimes it's better to pay your debts to society instead of being forever on the run. And for once, just put aside those senseless, adventurous pretensions of yours. They've already cost you your friends and family. I beg you, Kate, please come back and say goodbye to your mother. Call me so we can organize your return in the best conditions possible. I've enclosed your mother's pendant. According to her, you used to love the mystery of its melody. I promised her I would send it to you. Call me for the sake of what's left of our friendship. Olivia, 212-359-1519. Well done, Donna, dear. I'm so proud of your concert on the square at the Academy of Music. We shall find a pretty frame for your diploma. Thank you, Mother. Once you've finished your studies at the Academy of Music next year, you'll be able to start higher education at the Paris Conservatory. Won't she, Anton? Of course. Of course. Then, my darling, you'll become a great concert pianist. You make us so proud, doesn't she, Anton? Of course. Of course! So proud. I can't wait to see the Paris Conservatory, even though I'll miss you both terribly. And it's perhaps not such a bad idea for you to move away from Wagen. Times are hard at the moment for people like us. <coughs> I do worry about your health still. Thankfully, Herr Gustav agreed to take you on at the mountain refuge this summer. Oh, yes. The mountain air will do you a world of good, my dear. By the way, did you write to Herr Gustav to thank him? Oh, uh, well, I was very busy rehearsing the concert, you know. The gentleman is offering you a job, Dana. Thanking him is the very least you can do. <sighs> yes, Mother, I'll do it right away.
I should think you'll be needing a pen to write that letter, my darling. The diploma Frau Beckmann gave me after my concert on the musical square. Thank goodness she didn't mention I almost arrived late. Herr Gustav, my future employer. Thanks to this summer job, I'll be able to help Papa pay for another year of schooling at the music academy. My pen? Hmm. Can't be far. Papa, could your pen be around here somewhere? Could be, I suppose. Papa is so untidy. Papa is so untidy. Herr Renner, I would like to thank you for... Here, don't, 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 Anna, it's too dangerous. Oh my, what in the name of... Dana, darling, no. No, give it to me, please. Oh, my goodness. What does it say, Father? It's nothing, Dana. Nothing but spite. Will they ever leave us in peace? Come on, Lena, my dear. Hey, come on. Look at me. Don't let it get you down. Huh? Or we'll both end up in Paris with Dana. Piss off out of here, you filthy Vagarins. Horrible! Kate, come on. We need to get to work now. That's it. 
I'll get started working now. You push the cart closer and come dig next to me, okay? I'm very sorry, love. But we'll have all night long to cry. Brakes are on. <laughs> what a surprise. I didn't see. Hey, look! Come on, let's go and see. That could be our ticket out of here. Let's check it out. Oh my god!
better try something else. No. Hmm. Still looks pretty strong. This carriage is more luxurious than the other ones. Maybe a dignitaries? There's a dead body inside. Leave it alone. You'll bring us bad luck. Looks like it was caught in a rock slide decades ago. Crazy to think that no one's found it. Until today. More bodies. Looks like they were shot dead while they were eating. More bodies. What happened here? looks pretty strong. Must have got it wrong. That doesn't work. No, I don't think so. It was caught in a rock slide decades ago. Crazy to think that no one's found it. Until today. Don't know if I want to go back and see that body again. Beside, Katusha's waiting for me over there. This carriage is more luxurious than the other ones. Maybe a dignitaries?
That's deep. <sighs> Can't even see the bottom. Yeah. And it means the tunnel on the other side is cut off. Must be the way out. I can see the light at the end. How do we get across that? I'm sure there's a way. Follow me. I have an idea. be the way out at the end of that tunnel there if we build up enough speed we should be able to use the height difference on the edge of the precipice as a takeoff ramp to get to the tunnel on the other side and then get to the surface. Sure, that is if you can get the thing started. Don't worry about that. Back in the days with my band, I always used to repair our old van on tours. Okay, but wait a second. First, I want to take a closer look at these bodies and maybe figure out what happened here. They were shot in the back. Same as those over there. Looks like Second World War uniforms. They belong to the Brown Shadow, the fascists who triggered the war before they herded up and massacred millions of innocent people. Full tank of gas. And it looks as if they were headed for the exit tunnel. It's like they were ready to head out. Looks like they were in a hurry, judging from their position. I wonder how a bunch of World War II fascist soldiers ended up here. Right. And who killed them just as they were about to ride out of here. One thing's for sure, though. We've got to give this motorbike a try. What? What are you saying? You mean you want to jump over the ravine? Exactly. But the keys aren't on the bodies, I checked. They must be somewhere inside the train. You go and find the keys while I take a look at this motor. Will do. You'll be okay? Don't worry, love. I'm sure this beauty and I, we're going to become best friends. alone the train. Sorry, whoever you were, but I need to do a quick search.
So this brown shadow officer shot his own men, and then, strange, a hollow shape. There must have been something in it. He wore stripes. Must have been the brown shadow officer in charge of the train. Shot himself in the head. Awful. Major Sutel's last drink to give him courage? Nothing interesting here. I don't think I can make any use of that. Distinctive symbol of the brown shadow fascists. Many countries have banned it, and that's just fine by me. One of the keys is still covered in blood. Must be the one for the motorbike. It hasn't been started for too long, but leave me to it and I'll see if I can get it going. If I can just get it to kick start, we might be home free. Okay, I'll leave you to it then. I'm gonna go search the train a little more. Maybe I'll find something useful for when we get out of here. Sure. to the carriage.
Your chariot's waiting. Hey, what are you? <gasps> Holy crap. Wow, this is worth a fortune. I can't believe it. This is gonna come in nicely when we're on the road, babe. A masterpiece. The brown shadow must have looted it during World War II. to think what became of the owners of all these stolen objects. What is it? It's incredible. You gotta see this. Yeah, it's pretty well done. I like the color of the rock face there. Is that what fascinates you? No, Kate. There! Look! It's right under your nose. Dates from 1937, apparently, but I can't make out the signature. Cola? Coba or something like that? Anyway, what's so fascinating about it? You mean you can't see? Take a closer look. Sorry, you'll have to be more specific, Katusha, because I still can't see. Look again, there. The girl. She's your spitting image. Well... You really think she looks like me? Come on, you gotta admit it's incredible, right? Either way, I suggest you put it away. We better get going. must be priceless. Now I understand why the brown shadow wanted to hide the train so badly. There's a veritable fortune in loot here. Kate, you gotta admit she looks like you. It must be a sign. Hold it right there, girls. All right. You've caught us. But take a look inside this carriage. The train is full of treasure. We can all escape with, with tons of it. Just, just look. Don't move.
Listen to me, Simona. You've always been good to us, so why can't we help each other now? We'll be stronger together. <laughs> sure. You've been nice little prisoners. I have nothing against you personally. But... Why can't I... Keep the treasure for myself? I could leave this rotten prison. Nobody will know. I could even say you tried to escape. Which wouldn't be a lie. But Simona, don't! Don't take it personally. I just need a change of life. I think you can understand where I'm coming from. No!